summer of 2010 was an active severe weather season in Stearns County. Straight line winds, three tornadoes, and a large hailstorm hit our county. All these are examples of the types of severe weather we experienced during our summer storm season. The risk of severe weather is very real. As of 2009, Stearns County was ranked third in the state of Minnesota for the highest number of tornadoes in the previous 50 years. When severe weather hits, it's important that you know the difference between a severe weather watch and a warning. A watch is issued when conditions are favorable for tornadoes and severe thunderstorms. A watch means you should go about your normal business and you should stay alert and tuned to your local media. A warning means that severe weather has been reported in your area. When the danger is severe, such as in a case of a tornado, the outdoor warning sirens will be sounded. Sirens are located in cities throughout the county. The intent of the sirens is to alert those people who are outdoors to seek shelter. They are not intended to provide warning to those people indoors. Once inside, move to a lower level of your residence for additional safety and tune to your local media for additional information about the warning and actions to be taken. Sirens are sounded in Stearns County under the following situations. When the National Weather Service has issued a tornado warning, a tornado or funnel cloud has been spotted by officials, a severe storm is producing winds in excess of 70 miles per hour, or there is golf ball sized hail that's been identified. We get questions from the public about why severe warning sirens are sounding when it doesn't seem that bad outdoors. My response is this, right now the weather may not seem bad, but just a few miles from here, tornado may have touched down and that storm is headed toward town. The sirens were sounded to give you and your family as much time as possible to seek shelter and get information about the weather. When an outdoor warning siren is sounded, it will last for three minutes. When the siren stops, it does not mean that the threat of severe weather is over. You need to pay attention to local radio, television stations, or NOAA weather radio to monitor the weather conditions. If the siren sounds a second time, it means the threat is continuing or there is another storm on the way. It is not in all clear. Weather is very unpredictable and can change rapidly. In 2010, Minnesota experienced 113 tornadoes statewide, some causing substantial damage to communities. Our goal is to keep you safe. Remember, the intent of outdoor warning sirens is to alert people outdoors of severe weather dangers. Seek shelter, tune to the local media, and gather information about how you can keep your family safe.